Question number two says that the distance in kilometers of 40 engineers from their residence to their place of work were found as follows. So these are the various distances of different engineers from their residence to their place of work. We have to construct a grouped frequency distribution table with class size 5 for the data given above taking the first interval as 0 to 5 where 5 is not included. Then we have to tell what are the main features that we observe from the tabular representation. So to have a tabular representation, let's first have a tabular column. In here we have distance in kilometers, tally marks and the number of engineers. So before we start representing this data in this tabular column, let's understand what all do we have which is given in this question. So we have been given with the distances of the engineers from their residence to their place of work. So we can take that as D, which is given in kilometers. The class size is 5 and they have given us that we have to start with a class which is 0 to 5. So the classes will go on like 0 to 5, 5 to 10, 10 to 15, 15 to 20, 20 to 25, 25 to 30, 30 to 35. Now we will have to see how many engineers do fall into these different class intervals that we have made. So in the first class interval we can see that there are a total of 5 engineers. So we write the tally marks as 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and we write the frequency as Similarly, for the second class interval, there are a total of 11 engineers. So, we write the tally marks as this and we will also have to write the frequency which is 11. Again, in the class interval 10 to 15, we have 11 engineers. So, we again write the tally marks for them and we write the frequency. In the class interval 15 to 20, there are a total of 9 engineers. So we write the tally marks and we also write the frequency for it. Similarly for the rest of the three classes we will be writing the engineers that are falling into that class interval and we will be writing their frequencies as well. So now if we add up the frequency we get a total of 40 that tells us that we have not missed on any of the engineer. So from this we can observe that there are 5 engineers for whom the distance D is less than 5 kilometers. That is their office or the place of work is less than 5 kilometers from their place of residence. Now there is a majority, a majority of engineers that is a total of 36 engineers for whom the distance D is less than 20 kilometers. And then finally, there are four engineers for whom the distance D is equal to or greater than 20 kilometers. So these are the main features that we observe from the tabular representation. To learn more about how QMath can help you crack school and board exams, explore QMath Leap, a live online classroom program run by highly experienced and committed teachers.